Hello, welcome back for another floral design session. This is basically floral design 101. So, hope you're learning something and leaving some comments and asking some questions. I'll get back to them as soon as I can. You can also email me and you can telephone me if it's a floral design emergency. They happen sometimes, you know. I mean, accidents happen too, but floral design emergencies happen quite frequently, you know. Your florist didn't show up, <laughs> you're screwed. You have a floral design emergency now. But today, we're gonna learn how to do a little basket arrangement, which is quite different from a vase, and it takes a little more time and a lot more work, and frankly, they're a pain in the you-know-what. But people like them, and they are all for all kinds of different occasions, get-wells, birthdays, and they get bigger for funerals and things like that. So. We're going to learn how to set up the basket, how to green it, and how to put a little flower arrangement in it. This is about a seven or eight inch basket. They come with a liner so the water doesn't leak out because flowers do need what? Water. Yes. Very essential. So do we. We need water too. But flowers really need it. So here's my basket. We're going to be putting in what they call oasis, which is like a super soaker sponge that you can stick flowers in and other things in it. And we're going to cut this to, to size. Put it in there and get it in there good. And as you can see, that gives me a gap around the edge here and here, here and here. So I'm going to cut a smaller piece. I'm going to wedge this little piece in the side. Push it down. And for the same on the other side. Push it in there. Now, that holds this very securely. I also like to turn it perpendicular to the handle. Perpendicular as opposed to parallel. I didn't know this was a math class also, or geometry, but hey, perpendicular, this is parallel to the handle, and this is perpendicular to the handle. It's at a right angle to the handle. So I like to turn it like that, so I can take a little bit of clear tape, just put it around the handle, and hold it over stretch it and hold it over the handle, over the oasis, a couple times, just to hold it in place. Because in case our, the arrangement, say, in the truck would take a little topple, you see, it won't come out. See? It moves around, but it won't come out. Just a little safety precaution. So there we have it. Get this situated again. Okay, so there we go. Got our oasis in. Now I could just go put my flowers in here, but flowers are airy. You're gonna see through them. You're gonna see the mechanics. This is what we call mechanics of the arrangement. So I have to green this up. I have to put some greens in this. We're going to use baker fern, which is very popular, been around a hundred years probably. And we're going to break it up and we're going to poke it in and we're going to cover the mechanics. Some designers green lightly. Some designers green a little heavier. I'll admit it, I tend to be a, a little heavier design, greener. Because I don't like to see the mechanics. And I don't want the customers or the recipient to see the mechanics, of course. So I green a little heavier than most, maybe. Just a moment. 